What is happening, Magnesites? You know, uh, if there was a guy that I was going to emulate, you know, in my acting career, it'd be this guy here, you know. So first of Stallone, you know, he, uh, he inspired me when I was a little boy, you know what I mean? Uh, with the Rocky movies, not so much Rambo. I liked Rambo, but, uh, you know, really the Rocky movies, his longevity, you know, his, uh, his bodybuilding uh, addiction, you know, his fitness, his physique. And he's still doing it, you know. He's still doing it. So, if there was a guy that I would want to emulate more than any other actor out there, you know, it'd be him. So, I'm really, <laughs> really get a little nervous there. I'm really excited, you know, to uh, do a reaction to this. Lessons, no question about it. Right away, you're rolling tomorrow. I'm very, very proud to be here. I didn't expect this, but I'll just keep it short and sweet because there's no such a thing as a speech too short. When I did Rocky, <laughs> his voice is Al Pacino ish now, ain't it? If you remember, the first image was a picture of Jesus, and it says Resurrection AC Club. I found a church that had been converted to a boxing ring. So the image pans down from Jesus onto Rocky being hit. And at that moment, he was a chosen person. And that's how I began the journey. Something oh, okay. was going to happen. This man was going to go through a metamorphosis and change lives, just like President Trump. <laughs> We are in the presence of a really mythical character. I love <laughs> mythology. And this individual does not exist on this planet. Nobody in the world could have pulled off what he pulled off. So I'm in awe. Mm. And I'll just say this, and I mean it. I guess see Tom in a speech. <laughs> the great Sylvester Stallone called me mythological. Like a god, like a demigod. So is that something like Thor or something like that? And get a hammer here, Melania. You hand me my hammer, Mjolnir. Marvel, can I be <laughs> When George Washington defended his country, he had no idea that he was going to change the world. Because without mm -hmm. him, you could imagine what the world would look like. Guess what? We got the second George Washington. Congratulations! <laughs> I cannot tell a lie. That was a good short speech, Stallone. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, man. Hey, you know, I'm looking for the man to do great things. He promised us a lot of stuff. They say that, you know, uh, politicians promise a lot, deliver a little. I hope that he definitely promises, I mean, delivers as much as he promised. I am down. I am ready. I don't know what the hell y'all are talking about with this whole Hitler stuff and dangerous and our democracy and we're losing our rights. Oh, no. <laughs> I don't understand it. It just sounds like insanity that permeated into certain people's brains on the left. It doesn't make any sense, but... Post the comments down below. Let me know what you all thought. If you enjoyed my reaction and thoughts on this, hit the like button, subscribe, and share. 10 million subscribers. Woo!